Nichols our signing table. And Brandon, yeah, she went uh, right into that table. We had the table in for a signing of a contract that was coming up later on in the program that day. Here she is now. Here is seeing it. Daisy Cornett. some things that need to be made clear. First of all, there's a lot of people around Power Pro Wrestling that are trying to instigate trouble within the organization. I'm talking about between Steve Bradley and between Mick Tierney. They're pushing, they're stirring, they're instigating. But we had a team meeting. We met with the organization this past week and the situation with Bradley and Tierney is over with. They are cool, they are calm, they're members of the family. There's going to be no trouble. Now then, does Mick Tierney know that? Yes, he does. Okay. Yes, he does. Okay. Yeah, thank you, Kevin. Yeah, don't try to stir up anything. Now, what we're here to talk about is the attempted assassination last week on the part of Brandon Baxter trying to mutilate a poor Christian young woman like Finn. He picked her up bodily. Oh, shut up. You reprobate. He picked her up bodily. And he put her high in the air. And he flung her through an eight-foot table. He did not. He did, did too. And now, as a result of his crimes and misdeeds, he's not even here today. That gutless coward, Brandon Baxter, is not even here today. Well, I, I tell you why he's not here today. Brandon's been out sick all week with the oh, flu. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's at been home sick. in yeah. Arkansas. I don't need anymore. He's sick, all right. He's sick in the head. He's psychopathic. And he will pay for what he did to this poor Christian young lady who is standing here in pain. But a tribute, a profile in courage, this poor young lady after what happened to her last week. That's right, Brandon Baxter. You tried to get rid of me for good last week, but you didn't get the job done. And I'm back. And by next week, I'll be 100%. And there's a lot of people in PPW, and especially you, that are going to have to repent by the time it's free. That's right. And I'm going to tell you this, Brandon Baxter, you didn't get the job done. From what I understand, talking to a lot of women around Memphis, you never get the job done. But I've got somebody who can get the job done because you see this man right here. His name is Seven. He's six feet five. He's 275 pounds. He has no compassion for his fellow man, and he feels no kindness in his heart to anybody. His sole mission, his sole purpose in life, and his reason for existence is to do my bidding. And originally, he was to be my bodyguard. But now that I see that there's a person like Brandon Baxter running around and many more gutless cowards behind him, I have assigned seven to sin. Whenever sin is around, seven will be close by. And when sin isn't around, seven will be doing the organization's bidding because he is that bad, he is that mean, he is that tough, and you people are going to find that out. And as for this Ali, Glenn Kalka started today, but soon it will be finished because Glenn Kalka is the first man that will ever bring Ali to his knees. I tell you what, I'm looking forward to the opportunity. Uh, thank you, Jim Cronin, for me to finish off all these things going on here. Hey, what what are you are you? Call me for the interview. Why don't you come get me a lot? I, I told Steve to, I told Steve to take I, I asked him. Steve. Steve. No, I, I was. I, I forgot. It just slipped my mind. I'm sorry. I, right, shagging idiot. You and your holy water faith. You think you're better than us, don't you? Well, you didn't forget. You were just afraid I was going to steal your glory. This is well, over. Hey, 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 wait a minute. Wait. No, 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 no. Put that fist down. No, no, no. Do not raise your hand in anger to a member of your own family. I told you this is settled. It's over with. No, no, hey, whoa, well, Jim. Jim, I, you know, I've been talking to him. I've been trying to tell him that this is no longer the era of the big giant monsters. People want a young, handsome, high flyer like Steve Bradley. Steve Bradley? Speaking of monster, son, maybe a best chick with your girlfriend because she wasn't complaining about the monster last night when we were doing a little full attack and... Hey, 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 all right. Guys, come on. What the hell is it the new day? No, 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 it's not going to happen in the new day. We got the... A little decision in the camp of Cornette. We got the debut of Blaze coming up and Walmart Tommy Rich, two sexy friends, Christopher, are going to face off here on the Power Hour. We'll be back.